But he's being told off by the referee there in the corner. Vladimir Klitschko. Austria not looking quite as happy, but messy that third round. And he has had a couple of stamina issues in the past. Vladimir Klitschko, who is apparently a hundred to one on favourite to retain his titles, immeasurable odds. And Jean-Marc Mormack still in it, throws the left hook. This is when he got David Hay in trouble in their cruiserweight unification scrap. I mean, Klitschko's actually burning up needless energy himself with all the wrestling up close, the leaning down on Mormack. He has an excellent jab, but when he uses it, he can keep the spell at long range where he wants him. But he's not using it enough. Mormack getting closer now, not enough, lot more success. But he's not been pinned on the end of the jab at the moment. Bobbing and weaving a bit more, Mormack. Trying to dig into Klitschko's chest. See, Mormack has to get close to do anything, and when he gets there, Klitschko's grab and hold. There they are, the elbow above the, the neck again. He's not going to chance to get any punches off when he gets up close. Right, oh, that's a beautiful shot, left hook. That probably is the end of the affair. Can Mormack rise? He smiles, he's almost saying no. I don't think there's a chance. 50th knockout on the verge. That's it. The promise is delivered in front of the 50,000 in Dusseldorf. And Vladimir Klitschko retains his world heavyweight titles in fight number 60. He is still top man alongside his brother. The Klitschko story continues. Yep, and the punches that finished the job were quality, one-class shots. Just the simple stuff, getting Mormick on the end of the punches.